Nose picking can lead to Alzheimer's disease. When a person picks his nose, he does not give the impression of an intellectual. But now scientists have found that an outwardly harmless occupation can lead to degeneration of the nervous system, at least in mice. In our nasal cavity is the olfactory nerve, which, as the name suggests, is responsible for the perception of odor signals. However, this narrow flagellum of nerve cells hides an ominous secret, it directly connects the air in the nose with the brain. Bypassing one of the most important defense systems of the body, the blood-brain barrier, which does not allow microbes and toxins to penetrate from the circulatory to the nervous system. The olfactory nerve bypasses this barrier, directly connecting to the brain. As a result, both bacteria and viruses take advantage of such a loophole that is not controlled by the immune system. Scientists from Griffith University, Australia, proved that chlamydophilin pneumoniae, one of the main causative agents of pneumonia in humans, is able to get from the nasal cavity to the brain through the olfactory nerve and cause disturbing changes in nerve cells. Naturally, the invasion of the pathogen into the holy of holies of the body does not pass without a trace, and the nerve cells immediately react with the deposition of beta amyloids. It is assumed that normally these proteins are involved in the antimicrobial and antifungal protection of the nervous system, but, in addition, their appearance in the brain is one of the hallmarks of the developing Alzheimer's disease. So far, studies have been conducted only on laboratory mice, but the results sound alarming for humans. In the future, the research team plans to test whether a healthy bacterium is able to use the human olfactory nerve to penetrate our brain. What does nose picking have to do with it? The fact is that unintentional damage to the delicate mucous membrane of the nose or pulling out hair can lead to an increase in the number of pathogenic bacteria that can reach the brain through the olfactory nerve. The study is published in the journal Scientific Reports.